welcome. Today, guys, I'm going to be sharing with you all my recipe for stuffed peppers or stuffed sweet peppers. And I have three large sweet peppers here, various colors. You can use any color you want. To make this, you'll need minced meat, mozzarella cheese or cheddar cheese, whichever one you prefer, some pre-boiled small pasta, I'm using bow tie pasta, chopped sweet peppers, and these are the tops of the sweet peppers. When I cut that off, I save them and I chop them up. Some marinara sauce, your choice, whichever brand you prefer. Chopped onions, shredded carrots, garlic, tomato paste, black pepper, and some chopped Chinese celery. You want to start by putting up a big pan to heat up, and to that pan, add in a drizzle of oil. When the oil comes up to temperature, add in the minced meat. You want to brown this meat. And I just want to tell you guys, if you're a vegetarian, you can use soya chunks for this. You would soak that soya chunks and you can mince it up fine or if you use a small cho soya chunk. If you're using the bigger one, I suggest you chop it up pretty small so that it can fit into the peppers mm. properly. And if you didn't want to use pasta, you can use brown rice mm. in place of the pasta. So I'm just going to let this chicken start to brown and then we'll move on. Okay, as the chicken starts to brown, add in the onions, the garlic, the carrots. Guys, you can use any kind of vegetable you want in this dish. Celery. And I'm using both the leaves and the stalk. And the sweet peppers. Mix Now I'm going to season this with some black pepper and a little bit of salt. We can always adjust the salt when it's finished cooking. Now add in that tomato paste. Let the tomato paste cook in here for about two minutes. You want to wake up the oils in that tomato paste. Next, add in your marinara or tomato sauce. Mix to combine. Now you want to taste this for salt and adjust your salt now. Okay, I'm going to take this off. Next, add in your pasta or your brown rice. And I'm going to add in half of my cheese because I'm saving half to top the peppers with. Now give everything a mix. Okay, now we have to stuff the peppers and I just want to give you guys a quick tip. When you're buying your peppers, you want to look for the bottom that has about four points and that way it will be able to stand up properly. So make sure you look for that when you cut your peppers open, make sure clean up all of the seeds and all of the ribs, give them a rinse out and put them into a dish where they can stand up straight. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my filling and I'm going to fill the peppers. So guys, I've stuffed the peppers and I still have some filling left over. If you want, you can eat this by itself or you can store this in your freezer and you can make more stuffed peppers in the future. This um, stores really well, it freezes really well. So to finish, I'm just going to move this aside and I'm going to top the sweet peppers with some mozzarella cheese or you can use cheddar cheese. Okay, now the pepper is going to your oven 350 degrees for about 20 to 30 minutes. So guys, after half an hour, the peppers are finished. I'm just going to let them cool down slightly and then I'll transfer them into a serving plate. So here you have it, my recipe for stuffed peppers. 
guys remember as I said if you wanted to make this vegetarian you can substitute the meat for either tofu soya or mushrooms make this recipe let me know if you like it remember to give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends if you like it thank you all so much for watching if you're new to my channel I hope you remember to subscribe and I will see you all another day with another one of my recipes enjoy Oh,